Okay, we have here Dr. Kosla, Dr. Vinod Kosla from Kosla Ventures. Welcome, Dr. Kosla. We are on behalf of ASE and the conference team. We welcome you here for the interview. Uh, first of all, tell us something about Kosla Ventures and yourself. Well, thank you, and it's great to be here. It's great to see a conference organized and uh, like this. Uh, I think data science needs much more attention, especially among researchers. Uh, what we like to do is look at areas and say, where can new technologies be applied? And data science is clearly one of the more significant technologies that we will need to address that has huge potential to do a lot of good. And so I'm very, very interested in it and looking at all the different fields in which can be, it can be applied. Yeah, I mean, we, we really loved your speech back there. So where do you think you see big data and data science in the next five years? Well, five years is too early to tell, too short a period to tell, but in general, I think more and more uh, data science will start to replace human judgment, things that humans are not good at, or even things where they're good but can be done better. And medicine is clearly one of those examples. But in every area I look, uh, data science has a role to play. Some um, very few areas where it can be applied. So, uh, what do you think are the industry expectations from the researchers on uh, on the basis of you know data science? You know, data science is getting a lot of attention from industry, and I think uh, maybe it's a problem that data science expectations are too high. Um, in every area, we we'll see significant improvement in price performance because of what data science offers. Uh, you know, it may be possible in medicine that a nurse can do everything that a doctor can do today because of the clinical decision support systems. Uh, maybe we can look at a lot more data for patient and analyze that data much more precisely than we do in medicine today. But it's equally true whether you're talking about Looking at consumer sentiment uh, in advertising technologies, we've seen a lot of data science applied. I think education will be in another area. We are using data science. We can give student by student care, which we can't afford to do today because your typical classroom may be 30, 40, or 50 people. That's right. Um, so almost every area I look, whether it's advertising or education or healthcare or finding terrorists. Yeah, that's pretty enlightening. Yeah, but thank you so much for being here and enjoy uh, enjoy the rest of the day. Uh, thank you so much for on behalf of the ASE conference team. Great, thank you very much.